to the Etsy Homestead and today we're going to refill our chicken's minerals. As you see, I got four different ones here, so we'll just kind of touch up on them real quick. We have this little holder here that we created for them. So, we'll start out with a little bit of our traditional, the main one, the oyster shell, which you can get in 50 pound bags. This one is the calcium that keeps their shells from staying not as hot, well, okay. The oyster shell uh, provides calcium so you have stronger shells. So you're less likely to have a break on you before you want them to or break after they lay them. So I just put a little bit in here. And I'll set some aside for the other ladies. The next one is, well, let's see, I, I kind of have a weird way of putting them in here. Oh yeah, I remember, sorry. Kelp, sea kelp, it's like our calcium, or not calcium, it's their, um, I know the word. Um, shoot, their vitamin C. Thank you, my brain just went poof. So, we give them a little, I don't have to give them quite as much of this. Of course, what's cool about chickens is they know what they need so they eat what they need the next one is charcoal and yes this is the charcoal that you it's the same type of charcoal you put in your fish tanks and um, this one is like I think it mostly like helps cleanse their systems and stuff so it's just pour a little bit in, in their little container here I'll have to get some more later in the week and the last is your grit which has it's also I just drew a blank. It's a digestive. It helps with their digestive system as well. So it's just your, looks like rocks. But they eat that. And the roosters eat it too. So it's not just for the hens, but again. They eat it to help with their egg production and everything like that. And <laughs> All the ladies being ladies. But anyways, but yeah, that's what we give our hens. So if that's something you haven't started yet with yours, you might keep that in mind to make sure that, uh, keep up with their minerals and they'll help their, their egg production and their overall health. Miss Piggy should be going into heat next week, next weekend, which is Christmas weekend. So if she goes into heat again, then we know we got her timing set and we'll be able to order genetic material. If you all didn't know, we have a live webcam of Miss Piggy's pen here going 24 7 it's on our website theochomestead.com we also keep a youtube channel 
uh, uh, YouTube Live going uh, that has both Miss Piggy's camera and the Piglet cams from over in Paddock 1. That's going 24 seven. So you can see that. Please uh, remember to like the video and subscribe and ring that notification bell for uh, us so you know whenever we upload a new video. Well, thanks for joining us here on the homestead today as we did these few chores that we've done. And uh, thank you, Leah, for showing us uh, her mineral program that she does for our chickens and uh, helps make the best eggs possible, right? Yes, and it's been a little bit of a learning process and keeping up on it is sometimes the hard part, but definitely keeping up on it and keeping up with the oyster shell and the grit is very, very, very important. It's it's like a week it's just a weekly chore on that part isn't it yeah yeah that is. they will go through more of one thing than they do of the other thing a lot of times i, I think the sea kelp which is for their vitamin c probably they go through the most uh probably they because they like the taste of it yeah they go through the charcoal quite a bit too but, charcoal um, yeah oyster you could put more in it so it lasts a little longer so in grit, you know, grit's used to help them break down the food that they eat. So, uh, yeah, th those are all great minerals that every chicken needs. So thank you for showing that to us. You're welcome. And uh, thank you for uh, watching us feed Miss Piggy here. And like I said, you know, here next week she should be going back in the heat. And if that's the case, we'll be able to schedule uh, for getting her AI. So, I uh, can't wait for that. So, more piglets. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, the, some of the piglets we have here on the homestead, uh, they'll be going to freezer camp pretty soon. And I can't tell you right now, but here locally, uh, you'll be able to go to a place here locally and get it uh, at a, a certain store. But uh, I'll wait to announce that store when it's available. So, uh, but thanks for joining us and I want you to make sure to like the video, subscribe, and ring that notification bell so you can get all these updates. Thanks for watching.